98.1 Minnesota's new country and Barry Allen. Yeah, we're all excited about Friday night out at Old Capitol Tavern. It's going to be awesome. Del Gray, drummer for Little Texas, is on the line. Hey, Bear, you doing all right today, man? I'm doing awesome. I'm actually really excited you guys are coming into town. Love you guys' music. And uh, I think you guys are doing a ton of touring right now, aren't you? You know something? We are. We, um, uh, you know, I, I tell people it's the best of both worlds to be in Little Texas right now because I get to be a rock star on the weekend and hunt with my family during the week. So we still do about 70 dates a year, you know, back in the 90s. Um, you know, we toured up pretty good. We do 250 to 300 shows a year and just uh, didn't, didn't know any better, but it really laid the groundwork to let us do what we do now. You know, back in 1996, you guys played in Oshkosh at Country USA in Wisconsin. I remember that. Do you? Absolutely. Then you might remember the guy that introduced you. That would have been me. Uh, <laughs> that that oh, was a while man. ago. You know something, uh, you know, uh, Minnesota and, and Wisconsin, they've always been great to us, all the the festivals and fairs that that happen um, uh, around there is just, um, you know, we love coming up in that area, and it's going to be a great show on Friday. Yeah, it certainly is. And, you know, a lot of people, uh, you know, that are kind of my age brackets, I'm not going to say how old I am or young I am, but, uh, (laughs) you know, they... They came into Little Texas. Uh, you guys were so hot back in the mid '90s. I mean, uh, you guys. Uh, the, one of the big hits that actually got me hooked on your music. Uh, it would have been uh, what might have been as, and it's still to this day one of my favorite songs. And then, uh, and then you guys had "God Bless Texas" and you kick a little. I mean, those things just were one after another. I think that uh, that fan base that you guys got from those hits, they stuck with you guys forever and, and even right now. Absolutely. You know, we, uh, we when we go out and play, we'll see. Uh... We'll see some old friends and old fans from the 90s. And, and now, uh, you know, some of them are, are grandparents and some of them are parents. And, and uh, it's just, uh, you know, it's, it's uh, country music fans and friends are, are just the best. And, and like you said, they stick with you. Uh, you know, thanks to country radio, they still play five or six of, of, uh, of our songs every day. And, it, uh, you know, it keeps us in business. Yeah, it certainly does. And, you know, you, the band's been around since the late 80s, and you guys took a little break uh, in 97, right? And then you guys got decided to band back together in 2004. That's correct. We, uh, you know, we, we had worked so hard during the 90s and just kind of time to take a break and kind of enjoy, um, you know, enjoy our houses and enjoy our wives or girlfriends or and, and some of the guys had kids back then. And, uh I tell folks that it, the the best thing that ever happened to us is for us to be able to take that break because basically when I climbed on a tour bus at 18, when I got off at 30, I was still 18 because I had no life experience. It was riding around on a bus and playing music. So um, it really afforded all of us the chance to grow up and mature and uh, and and be, become uh, you know citizens and and enjoy our t- the towns that we lived in and. And, and kind of grow up. And so when we did get back together, it just made us, um, you know, appreciate it that much more. And, and um, you know, we're, we're having a ball. We, we have a ball every night we play. Well, you know, and it's definitely when you guys get on stage, the party begins and you guys bring it all out. And I've seen you guys live a few different times. The first time I had seen it was like I was telling you back in Oshkosh. The, the, some of the artists that were back then, if I remember right, included uh, Jody Messina, Travis Tritt was out there. You guys definitely brought the show over all of them. And I, you know, what I love about <laughs> you guys' is, uh, music and what you guys do is, and a lot of artists it happens to, they, they do. Like you said, you're 18 and all of a sudden you're 30, but you're still 18. They just take it and take it and take it. And, um, you know, y- y- you go 30 years. I mean, it's crazy. It's been like 30 some years that a lot of these artists will just keep going and uh, they're there, they're there, but they're not mentally there. And I think yeah. that little break is so helpful because you guys are just as excited as when you first started. It, it, it truly, you know, it, it truly was a blessing. And, and like I said, um, you know, we're, we're blessed to do this, you know, every day and, and every time we play, we just uh, get up there and have a ball. We have, we have a great time and it's going to be a great show on Friday night. I want to tell everybody to come out. And you're going to hear uh, all the hits and some surprises, and uh, you never know, you know, what what we might do. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. I'm looking forward to it. And you know, it's uh, really cool as well. I wanted to point out a lot of these bands that you see people, uh, you know, going to see. Uh, there's there's no original members hardly at all, and you still have all original members that started back when you guys first started. All, all, all four original members that started back in 1988. You got Porter Howe playing guitar and singing lead. 
You got Dwayne O'Brien playing acoustic guitar and singing harmony. You got Dwayne Probst playing bass and singing harmony, and you got me on drums. And and uh, you know, like I said, we we just have a ball and um, and are very blessed to to continue to do what we do. Well, that's true, little Texas, right there. I mean, you guys are as authentic as when you started, and that's what people are going to absolutely love. So, Old Capitol Tavern on Friday night, you guys are coming out there. Absolutely, it's going to be fun. I'm I'm pretty positive that it's. Uh, an outdoor show. So um, there'll be plenty of room. I want to encourage everybody to come out and we're going to have a great time in, uh, at, at the tavern. Yeah, it's supposed to be a beautiful night. So Old Capital Tavern, uh, the gates open at five, music starts at six, your headliner, Little Texas. And Dell, thanks for calling in and we look forward to seeing you out there on Friday night. Absolutely, Barry.